Hello Aquarius and welcome to Lotus Spirit Tarot. My name is Shannon Colleen and this is going to be a message from your ancestors. This came up uh, a little differently, which I've told all the other zodiac signs too. I was doing a personal reading and I don't pick the decks. Uh, Spirit picks the decks and I went to put these decks away and Spirit said, no, 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 no. The ancestors said, no, no, no. We have a message for all the zodiacs. So that's a little different. Um, yes, I am available for personal readings. And Aquarius, if you have not joined our soul, to, soul tribe, soul family, what is wrong with me, <laughs> membership, please do so. We have exclusive content, bonus materials, bonus offers. It's a great group of people. It's only $4.99 a month, so very affordable. And uh, if you would like to join us, all you have to do is go below this video. There's a little join button. Click that and put in your information. So, beautiful. Whew. All right, ancestors of Aquarius, what is the message, please? What is the message? Show me. The, okay. <laughs> so you, oh, you have fire. You are about to take some serious action towards some goals, some dreams, some desires. Um, you've made up your mind. You have the 19, which is a, which is a, which, if I could talk, which is a 10 in numerology, right? That is the ending of a cycle and a new cycle beginning. Now, I'm bringing that up because you also want to make sure you check your other placements, your rising, your moon, and your Venus, because a couple of these signs also talked about a completion and a new journey. So I think you have made up your mind to really passionately go after your desires. Like nothing holding you back. So let's grab the book here. And see what they say about fire okay so this says fire consumes anything that it touches the flames remind us of the impermanent nature of reality and how situations can quickly transform into beauty or chaos fire is passion and its dancing flames invite us to reach the sky warmth and light are heavenly yet too much heat can scorch us to fully step into the energy of fire is to be utterly transformed like the phoenix rising from the ashes. Can't make that up, right? Warm your hands and your heart by your inner fire. Yeah, you are. <laughs> you are going. You are going for it, right? You are going for it. So good for you, right? Good for you, Aquarius. There's nothing stopping you now. Let's see what we have in the tarot here. Give me a moment. All right, Aquarius. Let's see what we have here. Ancestors for Aquarius. What is the message? Okay. Well, our first card out is the Father of Horns. That is the King of Cups. Anything that had been turbulent before or where you were feeling emotionally in a different element, right? Uh, doubt, um, yeah, doubt comes into mind. No longer are you there. You are, passion is an emotion. You are taking this to the next level. You are the king of your domain. And it doesn't matter if you're male or female. But this is about taking action, right? Which is masculine. Taking action. Going for it. No, I'm not stopping until I get what I desire. Putting your emotions in the right order, right? I, I love this. Show me clearly, please. What do we have for Aquarius? Oh, this, and again, check your other placements. This Ten of Swords has been coming out quite a bit. I like the finality of it because now we have two tens, right? So look up angel number 1010. But also know that your thoughts of not being good enough or not being worthy or uh, your thoughts of I could never do this, um, they're done. You have a whole new way of thinking and you have a whole new way of feeling. And when you combine those two positive thoughts with the, you know, passion, the feeling, you can't be stopped. Okay? So this is like, man, it's your time to shine, Aquarius. Let me tell you. Show me clearly, please. What is the message? Whoa. All right. So we have, yeah, here's the new beginning. I love it. Remember I said you made up your mind? This is the Two of Pentacles. You made up your mind, okay? 
that's really what I get. Like, you made up your mind, and because you've made up your mind, this becomes something very tangible because it's pentacles, right? You root yourself into this new beginning, this new desire, and going after what you want. And again, this is the brand new you. This is you as the fool saying, I'm going to take this risk. I'm going to take this leap of faith. I'm going to go for it. What do I have to lose? Right? <laughs> Which brings me to a story, Aquarius. <laughs> and I'll always use my own life uh, to help it resonate with you. Way back when, uh, before I was doing mediumship, psychic mediumship for a living, of course, I had other careers, and I was uh, I was an optician. I made glasses, sold glasses, did all that good stuff, loved it. I was very good at it. And one day, a woman came into my office. She got a pair of glasses. She called me uh, a few days later and offered me a job in the finance world. And I was like, well, I don't have any education in that and this and that. She's like, yeah, but you've got, there's something about you. I really think that you should give this a try. And I remember uh, calling my father and saying, I don't know. I don't know anything about this, right? My whole life I've been an optician. This is what I've done. I don't know anything about this. And he said, what's the worst thing that can happen? You learn about money. So what's the worst thing that can happen if you go towards your passions, right? So I feel you do. I did. It was one of the best decisions I made in my life, right? So again, take the risk. It's going to be worth it. Take the risk. I'm not taking this because there's too many, but look. Choices, the lovers, choices. Make the choice to go for it. Take the risk. Yeah, look at that. I love the devil card, okay? Because this is talking about, and this did come out for Capricorn. So if you have Capricorn, go watch that one. Um, and it's kind of the same message here about being free, unchaining yourself, right? Unchaining yourself so you can take this risk. But it is also, and again, it came out in the same way for Capricorn, it is the card of drive, of success. Like nothing's going to stop me. I'm going to get what I desire. So I really love the fool with the devil here because it's saying I'm taking the risk. Everybody's going to think I'm probably foolish. I don't care, <laughs> right? Because I know the outcome is going to benefit me, right? And I think you do. I think you... Because of the balance with the mind and the heart, I think you just, you know it's going to work out. You know you're going to get that desire that you just have to take the actions. I've got to take the leap of faith. I've got to put my heart and mind into it. And that's where all my success is going to lie. Show me clearly, please, for Aquarius. Show me clearly for Aquarius, please. Ancestors, what is the message? Thank you. Yeah, so you have the nine of uh, of swords, which is that repetitive cycle of the same nightmare. Nothing's changing, right? It's because you're not taking action. You're not taking the right action. But I think that this all gets relieved because you remove this, right? And you replace it with, uh, you know, the desire. I'm going to get a clarifier for that too. Show me clearly. Show me clearly. What is the message, please, ancestors? What is the message? What is the message? What is the message, please, for Aquarius? Ancestors for Aquarius, what is the message? Yeah, something's been keeping you stuck from doing this. I know you overcome it. I'm just trying. Yeah, there we go. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, you do. Father of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, King of Roots, you are rooted in this for success. You totally abolish this by doing. And you're going to see whatever this is that you're going after is going to build and build and build and build and build. Because the King of Pentacles for me, the King of Roots, it, it, it just... He wasn't given everything, right? He went for it. He did the tangible things to get his wealth. So again, Aquarius, whatever this is, I just don't think anything can or will stop you right now. I just don't see it. <laughs> Whew. Ancestors, what is the message for Aquarius, please? 
ancestors what is the message for aquarius what is the message show me clearly what is the message oh there it is this says here mirror visions are you dreaming or awake there is more to reality than one there is more to reality than the one we are taught to take yeah you're shaping your own reality and that did come up in another reading too so you are definitely making the changes taking the action and shifting your reality that's awesome all right aquarius all of my love light and blessings to you until next time